Hey guys, Ty Cohen here, and I've got a, a a pretty different type of a webinar for you this week. It's a special training by a good friend of mine, Debbie Drum, and what you're going to see is a way where I personally have been able to make a lot of money over the last five, six years or so, just doing uh, something similar to what she's sharing with you during today's training. Um, so before I get into that, I just want to make sure that everyone realizes that multitasking is one of the worst disservices that you can do to yourself, right? Especially when it comes to a training like this, because you're missing out on like the bare nuts and bolts, right? The stuff that can really help you to be successful. So I want you to, to close out of Facebook to, you know, put away your email, put away your phone if you're plan on texting or catching up with someone and instead listen in and take notes because you're going to really get some great information on a process that like I said works really well for myself works really well for my guests works really well for just a ton of people literally around the planet right so I've got a good friend of mine Debbie Drum who is someone that's super super highly successful in what she'll be sharing with you as well as many other things as it relates to this industry and other industries as well, right? She's someone who I'm constantly learning from. She's someone who is just an adorable sweetheart when it comes to, you know, any and everything um, in relation to what you're going to be shown here, right? So she's someone that you, you can really learn a lot from, right? Now, with that said, I want to just make sure that Everyone can hear my voice. So again, if you can hear my voice, go into the questions box, and put a one in there. All right. I see we've got Jason. Jason, you're pretty fast there. I like that. I love it. We've got Maria. We've got Alba. We've got the ones. The ones are flying in. So it looks like everyone can hear my voice. And uh, when Debbie pulls up her screen in just a moment, she'll do a, a, a video check to make sure that everyone can see her screen as well. Um, just a quick question here. How many people have ever thought about publishing uh, coloring books? If so, just put a put a put a number another one in there. All right. If you've ever thought about or if you currently are publishing coloring books. And more specifically adult coloring books. This is a huge niche. And if you're not into this, you are listen when a, a mutual friend of, of Debbie and I, we have a mutual friend, a guy by the name of Sam England, who mentioned to me a few years ago, he says, Ty, are you publishing, you know, adult coloring books? And I thought it was the, for lack of a better word, the strangest thing. I'm thinking adult coloring books, right? Like, who does that? And then we had another mutual friend who I noticed in the, same area, right, who was publishing adult coloring books and was doing very well with it. So that piqued my attention. Long story short, I got involved and it's been one of the best things ever. Okay, so it just goes to show you sometimes you never second guess things because just because it's not something that you're totally familiar with doesn't mean that there's not tens of thousands or hundreds of thousands or millions of people or tens of millions of people around the globe that are into it. Okay, so that's business 101. Never just sell things, right, or services based off of what your personal likes are, right, because you may be missing out on a, a lot of opportunity, all right? So with that said, again, I've never done a webinar quite like this one before, so with, you want to take a lot of notes, all right? And I'm going to do the same. So Debbie... Are you there? I want to bring you on. The show is yours. I'll be in the background taking notes, and I'll chime in possibly once in a while. But for the most part, the show is yours. Debbie, I'm happy. I'm excited. Let's rock and roll. Thank you so much. It's always great being here with you and your folks. And I'm really excited about this topic, mostly because some things that we do online are not as exciting and sometimes a little bit mundane but what we're going to be talking about today is something that uses a lot of creativity uniqueness and 
uh, just fun stuff. And what also makes it fun is that you can make money at the same time. And I brought on one of my longtime friends. His name is Rob Howard. And I have met Rob actually um, from the very beginning when I first started in 2010. I saw that Rob was doing a lot of creative stuff online and he's still doing a lot of creative stuff uh, seven years later. I think he started a little bit before me though. You'll, you'll see that in a second. But, um, but yeah, Rob it, it does a lot of innovative things in our space and I'm happy to be working with him on this project. Hey Rob, how are you? I'm doing great, how are you? I'm doing great too. So I know that you, we have a lot of stuff to cover today, so why don't we go ahead and jump right into it. Awesome, sure thing. All right, well yes, I'm excited to be here and I want to thank you guys for coming. Um, we got a lot of stuff to talk about and I got a lot of things to show you, which I'm hoping that by the time you guys are finished, by the time we're finished with this uh, presentation, you can walk away with some really cool ideas um, that will help you make money. Now, if you guys want to learn some ideas that will help you make money, that will um, that's easy and simple to do and only requires possibly a few pushes of, of a button. Give me a yes in the chat box. Uh, I want to make sure that everyone's paying attention and are, is, is actually interested in this topic. So uh, let me know if that's something that you'd be interested in because I'm, I'm wanting to see. Uh, I'm wanting to see. Yep. Okay, we're getting yep some yeses here. Yep, of course. Yep, yeah, awesome, awesome. Okay, good, you guys are awake. Well, as uh, Debbie said, my name is Rob Howard, and I've been doing this for quite a while, actually more like nine years. I was doing it a couple of years before Debbie, uh, I met Debbie um, at an event, but I'm a programmer, entrepreneur, and author. That is me right there with my three-year-old, lovely three-year-old daughter, Anna. Um, I've been, as I said, doing this for nine years, self-publisher and a marketer. I've been helped countless uh, authors publish their books and make money. But enough about me, you guys aren't here really to hear about me, you're here uh, to hear about this and uh, coloring books and in particularly publishing uh, the concept of making money using coloring books. And coloring books is a huge niche, absolutely huge. 12 million books were sold in 2015, 14 million in 2016. Uh, a lot of people uh, are into it, famous people, government officials, royalty, um, Hollywood stars and actors and actresses and, and musicians. Everyone is into the adult coloring book niche. Everyone's buying these books because they have a lot of benefits. Primarily in that, they're de-stressing. And that's something that a lot of psychologists, actually, therapists are now pushing, de-stressing activities such as coloring um, coloring books. And, and for some odd reason, I don't know all the science behind it. Maybe some of you guys do. But there's a, there's a thing that happens in the brain whenever we color one of these books. And it... Uh, helps sort of alleviate the stresses of uh, modern day living. And so they're awesome. Uh, it's, it's everyone's buying these. And the great thing about these books in general is that unlike a book where you finish it, you've read the story, you put it down, you might reread it a couple years later, you don't have, you, you can't buy that book again, right? You, you, the, your customer, I'm speaking to you as uh, maybe a coloring book creator, or as an author, you know, they have you have to write a new book and they have to go buy a new book and then once they bought it, well they've bought it and then the same thing over and over again. With coloring books, if they consume it, they're going to want to consume maybe if they really liked it, they're going to want to consume it again, the same book because you could color that book in hundreds of potentially hundreds of different ways. And so a single piece of work that you create could potentially be sold by sold to one person. Um, several times just for themselves and not including gifts for other people. And so coloring books sell easily and you see them everywhere. They're all over the place. And surprisingly, they're actually relatively easy to produce if you've got some artistic skill, if you've got the budget to hire an artist, if you don't have artistic skill, or if you've got some easy to use software. And we're going to talk more about that here in a little bit. Um, and of course, with CreateSpace and Amazon, literally anybody can do this. And, um, and I'm going to show you guys some examples of people just like you and I, you know, we're not publishers, we don't have massive advertising budgets, people who are making money selling these coloring books in really unique and fascinating ways. And they do sell. And uh, they're becoming, they're becoming rapidly becoming a, a really popular novelty item. And so I'm really excited, even though like people are saying, oh, you know, the, the coloring book niche is, is sort of um, plateauing, and maybe it is on a grand scale, but there's all sorts of unique things that are, people are now starting to do to make some serious money with this, and I'm going to show you guys 
here in just a minute. But they do sell, and they will continue to sell for a long time. Um, I want to ask you guys, do you think if your book that you published was rank right behind Harry Potter, a Harry Potter book, do you think it would make money? All right, give me a yes in the chat box. If you think you'd make money with your book ranked right behind Harry Potter and Amazon, you think you'd make money? Yes. <laughs> People are saying, yeah, yeah, I think I'd make some money. Well, you would make some money because this actually happened, and this is a book that I helped um, help market and produce. And uh, here it is. So last year in 2016, around May 2016, uh, Harry Potter and the Cursed Child was on pre-order. Um, and here in the number four spot, this is the hot up-and-coming books, the number four spot. This is Teacher Swears, adult coloring book. Um, yeah, this was a person, just like you and me, they actually they had produced and, and, and uploaded to CreateSpace a few coloring books, but they had never done this before, all right? And I walked them through the process, and I helped them, and... If you answered yes that you make some money, well, they did. They sold 2,100 single copies. 2,100 copies in a single day made $8,400. How would you guys like to do that? Right? I'm assuming that that's something that you would be interested in doing, right? duplicating this. That's not the only way you can make money. There's actually several different ways, and we're going to talk about those. Uh, there's actually six very simple ways to make money with coloring books. And the way that I just sort of pointed out was the traditional way. Okay, so what you do is the traditional way, you create a coloring book, you upload it to Amazon, you drive traffic to it, you make money. This is really effective if you make your coloring books unique and you time them very well. Teacher Swears was brilliant. We, we put together, I'm, I'm going to pat myself on the back here, all right? We put together a brilliant marketing plan. Um, we marketed it at the end of the school year. We targeted it towards teachers and we targeted it towards parents uh, and friends of teachers who would buy these as gag gifts, okay? Um, and so it was unique in that it was swear words that teachers could say in a classroom. All right, they can't just drop F-bombs in a classroom, right? They can't do that. You can't do that. No, no, no. So instead, she created this book like um, to be more of a gag gift style for teachers, things that they can say in the classroom. And then we put together a well-timed marketing plan, and uh, and as you can see, it was highly effective, very, very, very effective. Um, and it's not the only one, of course. There are tons of examples of this. Uh, for, this is one swear word coloring book, the Jungle Adult Coloring Book with sweary words and animals. Now, this again is another person, just like you and I. They're not a big publisher. They don't have a massive budget. Okay. And I, what's really funny is I know exactly what they're doing to market this book. I know exactly what they're doing to market this book, and uh, we're going to talk a little bit more about that in a minute. But, um, you know, so they put together this book, and, uh, you know, they're selling it on on, uh, on Amazon and CreateSpace. And so, again, this is the traditional way. Um, as you can see, a number one bestseller, surprisingly, in sculpting technique. I don't know how they got in that category, but 622 customer reviews released last year. It's doing an awesome push. They're making a lot of sales right now. It's doing really well. Uh, so how do you produce a coloring book like this? Well, we've got a few pro tips for you. You can use public domain images. Free images that you can use for coloring books or any marketing that you do. Pixabay is one potential site. And the software that I'm going to show you guys, you can use these images with this software to produce these coloring books. I'm going to show you guys that here in a little bit. Uh, but here's an example of sort of what goes in these traditional sort of coloring books. Um, this is artistic or art produced like mandalas or very artistic flower shapes, um, fractal patterns and that sort of thing. Um, but while those are traditional, you can also use regular images as well. And so this is just regular images you can download that you can use some software to convert into line art. And well, as again, we're going to show you how to do that in a minute. Um, so you can use that and you can combine them with uh, coloring fonts is what we call them from defont.com. Um, so bubble letters, bubble letters.ttf is a font file. As you can see, perfect for coloring. And that's the bubble letters is actually what our, my author for the uh, Teacher Swears did. She, uh, uh, she used bubble font, and she put the swear words in the bubble font with the pictures, and then, you know, you color those in. Uh, and you can also do all sorts of things. You can use pithy sayings, for example. Uh, you can put these sort of sayings, like, for example, by Albert Einstein, creativity is contagious, contagious pass it on, in the bubble font, overlay it over a picture. 
Okay, so that's traditional method number one, right? That's the method number one, the traditional way. Usually when we think of publishing coloring books, that's the way we think of it. But there's five additional methods that you can use to make money. One of them is the free traffic magnet method. This is where you use it to gain opt-ins, leads, and uh, this is where you don't necessarily create a book per se. What you do is you use, like, for example, the software that I'm going to show you guys to create free coloring book pages that you can then turn around and give away in order to get opt-ins and leads. And you can use this for any business that sells information, publishes books, self-help, consulting, wants to build a brand. It does not matter. Uh, this is an excellent method for gaining leads in any, for virtually any business. And that's one of the things I like, actually, about coloring books uh, and about coloring pages is that you can use these and custom tailor them for just about anything. Um, it doesn't really matter whether you're using it to create, uh, to sell directly, coloring books to sell directly, or if you're using those as marketing materials for another business. There's actually a huge opportunity for this. So you can use these to build a list to promote your other coloring books. That's the most obvious. You can also use them to promote other businesses. All right. Now, a couple of my favorite methods coming up. Number three, community business method. Guys, the method, the couple of these methods I'm about to talk about are absolute genius, and this is where you're going to make a big chunk of your money. Um, and this is one of my favorite ways. Find a community. So, for example, a business, a theater group, doctor's office. Offer them a free coloring book that they can give away or sell to their clients. Okay, so, for example, a doctor's office. You walk in there, you say, hey, I'm a local coloring book artist. I'm just wanting you guys wanting to ask and see if you guys wanted a coloring book made of your office and of the people. And then you can turn around and you can give away and put, you know, this is actually brilliant for doctor's offices because, you know, you hate going to the doctor or the dentist. You're sitting there bored to tears. You're supposed to be reading, flipping through the magazines. You know, you don't really like to do that. Coloring books is an excellent way to distract people while they wait. And so doctor's offices, any sort of waiting room area, perfect for this. And you just go, you take their pictures, and you use the software, convert it, real easy, real simple. You make a lot of money doing this. Um, I know several guys who are doing this right now. One guy did it with a freaking hospital. And so what you do is you create the coloring book for free, and then you just send them the Create Space link or the Amazon link, and then they go and order it. And people can order these in the hundreds because what they'll do, especially at like a doctor's office, they'll order 100 copies for them to set out throughout the office. Right and to keep or to give away and and something is extremely profitable as a doctor's office they're going to want to do that you can also set up advertising income with this there's a very creative way that you can use you can do advertising uh, I know one guy who in his community is he he's hit up all the restaurants in the area and he's created a coloring book of all the restaurants and he includes coupons in the back and he charges up front for this so he's like you know the, each one of these restaurants is paying him like 100 150 bucks. And then they buy the, the coloring book. So he's double dipping. He's paying, they're paying for the advertising in the coloring book, and then they're buying the coloring books themselves, right? And he's this, this guy's making a, a decent chunk of change doing this. Uh, you can also hit up, for example, your local town halls, you know, events. You know, you got like, uh, you know, you got county fairs, you've got local events, and all sorts of things that you can do. And here's an example image, actually, of a coloring book page. This is the Punka Theater in Punka Oka. Oklahoma, excuse me. Um, so this would be an example of a theater where somebody, um, you know, sold a coloring book to this theater, and uh, you know, this theater then gives them out or sells them um, as part of uh, as part of some of the marketing that they do. So you know, this is a, a good example. Now, this idea, this is an, uh, another author that I know of, or a coloring book creator that I know of, who 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 gave me this idea. I can't take credit for it. Uh, basically, he said, you know. I wanted to create this coloring books, but who would actually buy it? And he had this idea. He was friends with um, this belly dancing troupe. These are a group of like dancers. They're entertainers, right? And so they would go around dancing, entertaining. And he's like, you know, I'm going to take pictures of you guys. Would you be interested? I'll make you this coloring book. Um, would you be interested in something like that? And they're all like, yeah, of course, because it's custom. It's of us. It's cool. So he put together this co a coloring book. He uploaded it on Amazon. He shot them the link. He's made over $1,000 in profit from that idea, $1,000, because what happens is they buy it, they love it, they color it, they show it to their friends, their, their friends like, I want a copy, they go buy it, they buy it for their friends, they buy it as they travel to hand out again 
or to sell, they sell other copies themselves. So like this idea is where they're constantly buying these coloring books is not only because they think it's cool because they want to color it themselves, but they're also using it as marketing for their entertainment group, right? So this really simple idea resulted in over a thousand dollars in profit for this guy, and I'm sure that it's more. I haven't I haven't spoken to him in a while, but I'm sure that it's more than that right now because this is something they're continuing to do. And he, I think, the last time I talked to him, he's going to do a second coloring book for them. So again, he just keeps keeps using the same material and these same people, right? And he's just creating these coloring books for them, and it's awesome. Uh, now the next method, I'm going to turn over to Debbie. Debbie actually is very familiar with this method. This is a hybrid method. And um, she's going to walk through uh, walk through this. So Deb, go ahead. Hey, thanks. Uh, yeah, the hybrid ref method is perfect for coaches, consultants, authors, and speakers. So if you want to make money uh, above and beyond a book, this method is perfect. Um, and these are guides and companion books and workbooks and cheat sheets and checklists that you can actually incorporate fun, interactive coloring book aspects of these books. So uh, last year I went to a warrior event and I made this book. It's called the Warrior Survival Workbook and it's interactive and I sponsored the event and I and everyone got one of these books in like a tote bag. I think it was about a hundred people and uh, it was kind of gimmicky. I had a lot of fun creating this book. I actually documented every single day. It took me 30 days to make, and I documented every page of how I did it. And you'll be uh, able to see that a little bit later on. And I incorporated kind of like, um, you know, a note-taking interactive place where people can take notes and uh, you know their experiences of the event and it was really fun and the great part about it too was that I got a uh, everyone got a copy I got a shout out from the the MC everyone was sitting there holding my book or asking me to take pictures and everything like that so it was cool and as you know when we're sitting in the conference we like to you know doodle a little bit so I created this doodle page here you can see the bubble font uh, or the bubble light font that we used here, create your own success that they can color in and they can also color in uh, the flowers and the mandalas in the background. So, um, so yeah, this worked out very, very well. And obviously you're, you know, you're not really making money through, well, you can make money through the sales of the book, but if you're giving it away for free, you're mostly making money from the, stuff, the content that you're putting inside, you're directing people to go visit your online web properties, you're building a list, things like that. So this is a great way to, to utilize uh, coloring books with the, with the hybrid method. Yep, awesome. All right, and then there is the Fiverr method. Now this is if you're wanting to make money in, in some sort of way, like immediately, there's always a market for people to um, who are wanting coloring book pages made. And with the software we're going to show you guys here in a little bit, this makes this dead simple. And so um, you can use the Fiverr method to both create the coloring books. So, for example, if you want to create them, uh, have them created for you, you can uh, use, for example, Fiverr to do that, though it does get expensive. We'll talk more about that in just a minute. Um, or you can use grab potential clients yourself uh, with the software we're going to show you um, and yeah create a side income for you and they don't need to know how easy that it is so you know you can go on Fiverr and get that done um, build your Fiverr profile so um, a great way to bring in cash virtually immediately uh, without a whole lot of effort now there is one more method though and this is my favorite method. We call this the memories method. And this is a, my favorite method because you don't have to leave your home. You don't have to take any pictures yourself. You don't have to have a website. You don't need any capital. You don't need to waste money advertising. You don't need to focus on traffic or SEO or funnels or any sort of pushy sales tactics at all. All right? All you need to do is be able to create an image such as this and turn it in to a uh, turn like for example this wedding photo right turn it into a coloring book image and it's real easy to do once you have the software and you have the knowledge to do it and we're going to talk more about that in a minute but this is really 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 easy and now a guy I know he's currently made over five grand 
all right, doing this in a little under two months. And this is super simple. And I hope you guys are excited because I'm excited to share with this, uh, share this with you. And it's something every single one of you can do. And you can get started as soon as we're done with this webinar, okay? So what do you do? You just need a way to produce the coloring books and a Facebook account. And all you have to do, step one, join local, local groups, buy, sell groups, community groups, pages, all of the, 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 the local things that are going on in Facebook that has to do with your local community, all right? You get in there and you make a post and you say, hey, I'm a local coloring book artist. I want to turn your pictures into custom made coloring books. If you've got a birthday, if you've got a graduation, if you've got a, some sort of office promotion, um, special event, weddings, huge, huge weddings. Weddings are huge. Use the software I'm going to show you. You can produce the coloring book. So these people send you their pictures of their weddings or graduation, whatever. You turn it into a coloring book, and then you send them the link to, on Amazon. And what happens? They go and buy it. Now, when you first start off, this guy, when he first started off, he didn't, uh, he did not at all uh, uh, charge up front. He didn't charge anything. He just said, you know what? I'll do it for free. If you want copies of the book after I'm done, I'll send you a, a demo copy, and then you can order how many of the copies you want directly from Amazon. Here's Jim. This is his story. Now, he sent me this. this he posted it in a group where we talked about this. This was uh, two months ago, and as I said, he's well over this now, but um, just past the $1,000 mark in profit. I've only put about 20 hours in total with this. More people in my area are wanting these coloring books, and I easily expect to do a few grand a month just serving the small town that I live in. All right? He started last month in his spare time. Jim, all right, he's got a full-time job, or he did. I don't know if he's quit his job yet, um, but he has a full-time job. He worked as a factory worker, all right, a uh, forklift driver. He's looking for a way to get ahead and just make some extra money, and I told him about this. Um, and he grabbed the software. He started in immediately. He went and just posted in a group. He had a couple of bites right off the bat. A couple of uh, people, like some kids' birthdays and stuff, were interested. He made them a coloring book. He made a couple sales here and there. Word started to spread. He bagged. He ended up bagging a large wedding party after he put a little bit of time into this, and only about 20 hours. And then. Uh, about six, five, six hundred dollars of that, uh, that thousand dollars profit came from this wedding party alone. So, and he's at that point, he was only charging for copies of the book, right? They would go to Amazon and buy. He charged nothing up front, and that's why you don't have to sell anything, and you don't have to get in these groups, and you're not feeling like you're spamming because you're not asking for money, right? You're getting in these buy sell groups, and you're gonna say, hey guys, I'm a local coloring book artist. I'll make you a local. I'll make you a coloring book for free. 20 pages, 20, 20 page coloring book of your event, of your kids, or, or, or maybe it's a, a long event of your kids growing up. You got, you know, you got pictures from your childhood you want, I'll turn it into a coloring book for you. All you got to do is just when you're done, just go buy the book off Amazon if you want, okay? And people beg to buy these. You're not selling anything. Nothing is being sold here, right? You're having, this is a free offer. People are biting at the free offer because they're getting a custom coloring book made. I want you guys to think about this for a second. Let that sink in. This is a custom made coloring book and people are begging to buy these. Now the, the, the beauty behind all of this is, is Jim now, right? He's using the software we're going to talk about in a minute. He just, people hand him the pictures. He uses the software. Now he's actually outsourcing the software usage and he's outsourced the um, taking care of like the images and stuff like organizing and that. He's got another guy that does it for him now. He's just sitting back and collecting the cash and interacting with people on the Facebook pages. He's having fun interacting with his community. His, the, his community is starting to love him and he's making friends, right? And he's making a full-time income off of this, just this single idea alone. And I told him, and I don't know if he's doing this now or not. I think he is. I told him he's going to start, need to start charging money up front for additional options. So for example, 20 pages for free, 30, 50 pages, whatever. It's this X, Y, Z. Okay. You charge this much. Um, and one of the reasons this works, especially for wedding parties, and we're going to probably talk about this more uh, towards the end, but if you want to think about this, if you were to get, if you were to ask a photographer, a wedding photographer to do this for you, you know what they're going to charge? 2000 3000 bucks. But because of what I'm about to show you guys here in a minute, you can totally undercut this, and you can serve a market 
that is currently being underserved and not served at all. So we're creating a market here because technology is going to allow us to automate things that would normally take people hand by hand hours and hours and hours and hours and hours to do, which is what we're about to talk about, right? The biggest problem with all of this is creating coloring books are time consuming and expensive. So I asked a coloring book artist, I said, you know, what did you do? Um, a coloring book author, and she said, you know, I, I, I pay someone to do it, five or 15 bucks on average, you know, about 60 pages, we're talking about $500, really, 500 to 1500 bucks. Um, here's graphic designers and illustrators on Upwork, $25 an hour, $45 an hour, $50 an hour. All right, so we're talking about a minimum of 20 to 30 hours to put together a book. We're talking about 500, 1,000, 1,500 hours, or $1,500, and I can already, I don't even need to ask, I already know but that's a lot of out of pocket and that makes that memories method invalid you can't use that memory map method if you use it if you're creating coloring books like this because you cannot get your prices cheap enough for the mass public to want to get custom coloring books made all right so we're not going to bother with that all right well the other option usually uh, what people think is learn how to do it themselves okay fine we'll just go ahead and buy photoshop which is a 239 dollar a year subscription um and then you got to learn photoshop you need to put probably about 15 hours into learning some photoshop and then you're going to have to practice and then finally maybe six months a year maybe if, it's, if you're really ambitious a month or two you're going to have to apply what you learned and then it's going to take time to do each one of these pages. All right, so how long is it gonna take? Uh, there was a guy, I'm gonna talk about Bill here in just a little bit. Bill actually put together a coloring book. He had a 30 page coloring book. It took him 30 hours, an average of an hour per page. Now, if it was two hours per page, if you're new to this and it takes you two or three hours per page, you could be looking at a single coloring book taking you 120 to 300 hours of labor for a single book, and you cannot do that. Again, now we're not talking about profitable enterprise here. What we're talking about is it'd be better for you to go work at McDonald's. All right, so you just don't want to do this. You just don't want to do that, and that's why these graphic artists are charging 25 to 40 dollars an hour because they know what their time is worth and they know the amount of effort it takes to put into one of these things. Okay, so we do not have time to do this sort of thing. We just do not have the time to do it. We can't do the do-yourself option. Ain't nobody got time for that. But, you know, there's got to be a better way, and there is. Wouldn't it be nice, really, to just press a button and make an entire coloring book that would be done in 10 minutes or less, and that you wouldn't have to spend 500 bucks for maybe a shorter book, $1,500 for one typical size 60 to 80 page coloring book. What if you wanted a series? $15,000 for an entire series it would be nice to not have to spend that money. Maybe not spending 30, 40, 50 hours per week, okay? So if someone were to create a piece of software that would do this for you, the software, if you think about this, that software could be worth a thousand bucks easily. One-time payment, right? Because you're creating an infinite number of coloring books and you're doing it and you're not spending 1500 bucks per book, you're not spending 15,000 for a series, you're not spending 60 to 80 hours a week trying to make a coloring book. All right, you have to ask yourself, how much is your time worth to you? All right, if you can have this software, something like this, you can grow your inventory at a phenomenal rate. And that's really what we wanna do. Now I wanna stop and make mention that what I'm about to show you is not gonna be $997. I just wanted to say that it would be worth every penny because if we're looking at the costs and the time that it takes to build a coloring book and to, for example, use this memories method, you know, it invalidates it. It totally invalidates it uh, with this. So we can't do that. But we want to make that possible and profitable for you guys. And so I want you guys to forget about spending all that money. I want you to forget about learning, your, learning it yourself, micromanaging, outsourcing. All you need to do is to not forget how to press a button because the coloring book creator, which is an entire package of combination of software and training that shows you how to create these coloring books and how to market them successfully and how to do it all instantly. Now, this has never been done on this scale before, not to my knowledge. Um, we're going to show you how to create coloring books in as little as three clicks, more like a click and a drag and then a click, but you know, I'll show you. So let's go ahead and demo this. So, um, you guys should be able to see on your screen the line art generator, which is one which is one part of the software. Let me let me show change this over here. I want this. 
If you have trouble seeing the line art generator, all you need to do is increase the size of your screen, um, which you can do that. Uh, the the, the GoTo webinar's got like a magnifying glass in either the top light, right or left hand corner. If you need to increase the size so you can see this a little better, please do because I want to show you um, this. So this is a line art generator. This is one half of sort of the entire package. Um, and what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you guys uh, how to use the software. And it's really simple. And as you can see, it, it's very, very simple, right? We, it's, it's, not, it's not complex. It's not even really pretty. It's functional, all right? And there's not a lot of options because there doesn't need to be a lot of options. All right, so let me show you how to do this. So we've got um, some previews here. This is what Bill did. This is the, the ones that Bill made. Um, uh, that coloring community coloring book, this is what he did. And as you can see, he did all of these images by hand, okay? And it took him an hour per image to do. And he had more images than this, but he just sent me these. Uh, so we got six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So this this right here, this folder represents ten hours of hand-drawn work. Or, or not hand-drawn, but handmade work, do-it-yourself work, okay? Um, right, so let's go in. So here's the original images. Okay, so there they are. So what we're going to do is we're going to click and drag, and I'm going to select all of these, and I'm gonna, just going to drag these into the input section. And you'll see a little spinner pops up, and then we've got the previews. So here's what we're going to do. I want you guys to pay close attention to this. Whenever I click on this, it's going to convert the image, and I'm going to do a quick countdown. I want you to remember that each one of these images took an hour to do by hand, which would also roughly translate to about, say, 25, anywhere between 15 to $25 per image. Okay, so here we go. 1, 1,000, 2, 1,000, 3, 1,000, 4, 1,000, 5, 1,000, 6, 1,000. Done. This image has been converted. Now there's a folder. This folder is automatically created. It's just a random name over here, and I'll pull it over and show you guys. Um, but here we go. Now, I know in the preview it's not showing that, but it did indeed convert, so there you go. Took six seconds what it took Bill a single hour to do, right? Now, let's take a look at these. So there's his, and there's ours. Now, if you'll notice, ours actually done it, has done it a bit better. The, there's like a space in between these letterings where he wasn't able to capture that. Um, there's a lot less uh, artifacting here, if you look at some of this, right? Um, again, cleaner lines. Took him an hour to do, six seconds. One hour, six seconds. Okay, so let's keep going. Let's uh, keep converting these. So we're going to convert the airport. While I go through and convert these, I'm going to talk about this for a little bit. What's, what it's doing in the background is it's analyzing the picture. It's applying some, um, some interesting artificial intelligence, deciding on where the lines need to go, how they need to be sort of uh, put in place. Um, the strength, the various strength and edge coarseness that needs to be applied. I really like this image here. Um, again, here's Bill's, right? That's what he did by hand. Let me show you his, uh, let me show you our version of it. Uh, again, cleaner. It's Ours is cleaner, all right? He, he spent an hour or so. Actually, this image, I think he told me he took like an hour and a half, two hours because it was a lot dirtier. Meh, our software took six seconds, all right? Uh, let's keep going. So the museum, and I think with the next image, I'll show you some of these. Um, these, I'll just give you a quick rundown of of the edge coarseness and strength. So these are your only options. These are the only options you need, by the way. Edge coarseness literally makes the edges a little more coarse, and the strength increases how strong the algorithm works on the image. Okay, you have two different desaturation methods, desat and grayscale. Generally, for most pictures, all you need to do is keep these the same. Okay, so uh, but let me show you just to give a quick example. Of this. So I'm going to change this up to about a 15, increase the strength by two to uh, like a six, and I'm going to hit convert, and it'll reconvert the image. And then as you can see, it increases the strength runs, how many passes it goes through. And then as you can see, we now have a lot darker lines. Okay, let me show you uh, this as the. So as you can see, it's actually created a really interesting effect. I call this the marker effect. If you're creating a coloring book that is a more marker-ish. Like it was draw, almost like it was hand drawn with markers. That's kind of the effect that you um, might possibly want to uh, go go for there. Okay, so uh, let's go back to uh, and just keep converting these. And we are almost done. Now, I mean, I've been blabbing a lot, right? So, you know, you could have had this done a lot quicker. 
In fact, you'd probably done by about 30, 30 images by now if you weren't uh, like me sitting here talking about all of this. Um, but just remember, each time we click on this image, that's another hour at minimum, an hour's worth of work that has been finished. Okay? And then finally, the Punka, the Punka Theater from, uh, from his book. So there we go. Ten hours worth of work done, six seconds. So this was a minute's worth of work. For 10, 10, minute, 10, uh, excuse me, 10 images, so if we, we uh, go for a full-size book of 60, you're talking about three, four, five minutes, you know, that's it. Now, there is one other half of this that I want to show you guys, and um, I'm hesitant to show you simply because it is, uh, we're currently working on it. It is beta, um, but uh, it is going to be included, okay, if you just, uh, when you decide to grab this. Uh, but this is the Magic Book Binder. What this does is it makes it easy to produce PDFs that you can upload to Create Space. So what we do is, again, everything's click and drag. So I'm going to click and drag all of these images. These are indeed the coloring book images. I know the preview's not working, but they are converted. Don't fret. Um, so we just drag them in here. These purple lines represent where the binding is going to go. So the binding is right there in the middle. You could change your global settings. These are your standard page sizes, your DPI. We're just going to set standard. We're going to do this as a landscape. We're going to leave all of this the same. All right, and then I'm going to go ahead and hit bind, and I'm going to name this test. Okay, and we're, con we're uh, binding these images together. And now, as you can see, it all looks funky, right? Because we didn't change anything. We still have to process them. But that's how easy it is. It's literally one, one click. Um, so let's go ahead and click and drag and select all of these. We're going to select uh, Resize to Fit, and we're going to rebind the book together, and I'm just going to call it, again, the same name. And uh, it's going to convert all the files. You see it's taking a little bit longer this time because we, uh, we are actually doing image processing. Um, and so there we go. Now everything's a bit, as you can see, a bit squished. So what you can do is you can go, okay, well, I'm actually going to rotate these images, right? So you can rotate them like this. And I'm just showing this as quick demo purposes. As I said, we're still working on the software. Um, we still got bugs and stuff to fix, but uh, it makes it real simple to bind books together. So eventually, when this is complete and this software is completely built, not only will you be able to craft the images themselves, you'll also be able to go through and uh, bind the books together with ease, all right? So we're, we're making this process as simple as possible. Okay, so let's go ahead and head back over to the presentation. So here we go from the current slide. All right. Talk about saving time and money. Are you guys excited about this? I'm excited. Does that look awesome that you would be able to sit and do this, and the methods such as the memory method suddenly become viable because what I just showed you isn't 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 uh, do it yourself. It's a factory here. Okay. Now I want to say that there's already been success. Okay. We've been slowly releasing this to people, and there's been a lot of successes already. This guy, he just he not long ago he purchased a uh, Gary is his name. Um, Two books. The night he purchased the software, he created two full-size books. He later told me there were 60-page books, 120 pages that he put together in that single night that he purchased. All right. This guy blows me away. All right. This this he sent me this email last month, uh, uh, actually two months ago now, at the beginning of September. 250 coloring bird books produced. In, in, in a month. In one month, he had produced 250 coloring books. Okay? I want you to like sit back and let that soak in for just a minute. 250 coloring books. Even if you went with the traditional method, say you don't want to do anything fancy, you just want to upload all of these to Amazon or CreateSpace. How could you not make money? I mean, even if each book just sells one copy a month, I mean, you're talking about now 250 sales a month, and if you're collecting, say, $5 a pop, I mean, that's a grand a month just from creating these coloring books. They don't need to sell. You have the ability, even if they just sell one a month, you, only, you have the ability to produce on a scale that has never been done before. 
And that is, of course, the old-fashioned method. If you're using, for example, the memories method, you now have the ability to create custom coloring books that takes you just a few minutes to put together. The clients don't know this. They have no idea. They think you're doing this by hand. To them, that's why you don't have to sell. You don't have to sell anything because to them, they're seeing the inherent value of what you're giving, giving them. And so what are they going to do? Of course they're going to send you their pictures to put together. Of course they're going to go buy it because now that you've done it, you're buying it off of Amazon. To them, it's a normal shopping purchase. They're getting little Timmy's birthday party in coloring book form. They're getting their child's entire life history in coloring book form. They're getting their wedding photos in coloring book form. People that would normally be paying two, three, four, five thousand dollars to a photographer are now paying next to nothing for you to do this for them, and they're getting their memories in coloring book form. And I want you to really think about that. Their memories. All right. We're talking about the emotional connection people feel here, the events that move people in their lives. All right. And you have the ability now to positively impact that. All right. So. Here's Bill. He basically said it took him 30 hours what the coloring book creator did in a minute or two. All right, he's again not the only one. The night before, created three months of coloring books in a single day. Again, someone else who had grabbed the whole package. And then, of course, we talk about Jim. All right, a thousand dollar mark in profit. This, of course, was way back when. He's now over five thousand in profit. He's got two people who work for him. <laughs> he does it in his part time like i it's just it's mind boggling but that's again because you're combining an awesome marketing method with a factory that enables you to produce coloring books cheaply okay imagine being able to create unlimited coloring books within minutes all right now this is back i i put this slide back together before we had a whole lot of solid case studies i mean i'd done a few myself but i mean these were people that are actually in the field customers like you that have went and and, and grabbed this and making use of it. 16 coloring books is what I estimated in eight hours, but I mean, we have a hard case study now. 250 coloring books in a month. All right, that's crazy, that kind of inventory growth. All right, so I mean, if you're asking yourself, okay, well, I can do one day, I could create 16 coloring books in a single day, and then I can have the rest four or five extra days off a week. You know, you could do this memories method. You could do the community books method, the traditional method, hybrid method. You could sell to consultants. You could become a consultant yourself. You could sell to offline businesses. And you, of course, you're not selling anything, are you? You're just collecting photographs and you're converting them into coloring books. Okay, and so instead of working for minimum wage, you're generating a near passive income by simply pressing a few buttons. All right, said one powerful tool, technically two powerful tools, and a full set of training packages I'm going to talk about in just a minute. $997 would actually would be a reasonable price because the sheer amount of labor that you're able to do in uh, just a few clicks makes this immensely profitable. All right? So if you're manually creating one coloring book a week, you're saving $52,000 or 1,500 hours of work a year, okay, if you use this tool. We're not going to charge $997, all right? Just bear with us for just a moment. Besides the software, there's also two different training things that you're going to get. Mac software training, we're going to show you where you can get uh, line art generating for the Mac. Now, the, this, this, I want to say that this software right now is just PC only, and in the future we might have it Mac, but we did include training to show you how you can do this just as easily on the Mac. So if you own a Mac, don't feel left out, okay? But the big one I want to talk about is the monthly marketing training, how to use the software whether Mac-based or the Coloring Book Creator Package, to make thousands of each month, details and case studies that authors like you have used. And we're not talking about theory anymore. We're talking about the real deal. Jim and his case study, he's one of them that I'm talking about in these monthly marketing trainings where I'm showing you guys how to get really inventive and how students just like you are out there in the field making money with this and making money with ease. The last training session I just had, like a week or two ago, we talked specifically about teacher swears, and I saw this book come up because this book right here, I know exactly what they are doing to promote this book and to make money. In fact, I, show, I, I showed in this training session exactly what they did, how an independent publisher just like you guys and just like me 
can do this. And I showed the exact traffic resource. It's free, by the way. I showed them the exact traffic resource. I showed them exactly how to duplicate their success. And you guys can join us in that. And all of the training sessions, um, get this. you can get this training session actually immediately. It's immediately available for replay. So you learn where this traffic source is, where she made $8,400 in a single day. I show you that traffic source. And guys, I'm going to tell you right now, it's something most people have never thought of. I'm not talking about Facebook. If you go back a slide too, uh, yeah, right there, you can see the Amazon bestseller rank. That book is ranked 433, 433. Yep. That's like selling thousands of copies a day, right? Yes, we're talking at least 2,000 copies a day. Wow. Okay, and I know exactly how they did it, and I'm gonna show, and I and I showed everybody this in in that webinar, and you guys have access to that immediately. Now I'm gonna turn this over to Deb because Deb's gonna talk about. Uh, some additional bonuses that we're also throwing in as well. Yeah, so we wanted to throw in the like a complete package so that you know how to publish not just coloring books but physical books from A to Z or A to Z if you are English, right? So <laughs> we are uh, bonus number one. We are giving you speedboat print publishing, and this is from my speedboat series where it's better to take the speedboat and get right to the information you need or you could take the rowboat and uh, go slower and figure it out yourself right most people want to take the speedboat so this will include step-by-step -step instructions on how to publish print books both full color and black and white on CreateSpace uh, it will give you free template resources so you never have to pay for templates uh, people are selling templates left and right. You don't have to do that. You get the formatting training. And you also, mo most importantly, especially with coloring books, you get extensive image training. It's actually the most important part of this entire process because CreateSpace will scare you and they'll tell you that you have all these errors in your book and you might be wondering why and you're going to literally want to pull your hair out like I did doing this case study and you get right to the answers. You don't have to figure it out yourself. And we also have cover training, front and back cover, and how you can do unique marketing tactics on your covers because we are self-publishers and we can be creative. And because things change all the time, all updates are included. Uh, this is a $497 value. Bonus number two, is uh, another program of mine. It's called Author Magnets Masterclass, and it's basically around the concept of book marketing is kind of dying. Well, it's not as important as author marketing, right? Author marketing is what you do along the way and how people get attracted to you, why they buy your stuff, you know, uh, generating fans, even generating what we call super fans who buy everything from you. So session one goes through the three things that every author needs to succeed and sell more books. Session two is cutting the line to find your target audience. You no longer have to do a million blog posts and a million videos anymore. Of course, that helps, but you can literally cut the line and get straight to your target audience, get right in front of them, and I'm going to show you how to do that. And also session three is really cool and pertinent to physical books because uh, we talk about physical marketing material. So if you go to like networking events, what are the things that sell your book? And here's actually a, a huge cost saving too because you don't have to print out a million books and hand them out if you're trying to market your books. You can do other things that are more cost effective and still um, you know, market your books and, and give people information about you as an author. That's a $297 value. Bonus number three, this is a great one. This is um, my interview with expert Judith Riles on Ingram Spark. So Ingram Spark is another publishing platform and it kind of rivals CreateSpace, I guess you can say. And oh, there's always a question of, you know, why and when do I publish to each platform? The main differences between CreateSpace and Ingram Spark. You know, should I publish to one over the other or both or what? 
Um, ISBNs broken down, how to get them, how to use them, what the heck are they. I didn't know a ton about ISBNs before doing this uh, interview. Uh, advantages of Ingram Spark, um, you know, should you publish to both again. And then uh, also, so there are some additional benefits of Ingram Spark, and that's why some people choose to do Ingram Spark over CreateSpace. There is a fee for Ingram Spark, so we have a special coupon code that reduces what you have to pay to publish. This is a $297 value. Great, great bonus with Judith Browse. Bonus number four, I alluded to this earlier. This is create a book with Debbie in 30 days or less. So you can actually create your book with me. And uh, a lot of the things that I do online, I take like really big projects and I break them down into tiny, tiny steps so that like writing a book, it's not a really big task if you only look at it as writing 400 words a day, right? And this isn't even writing 400 words a day because we're talking about images a lot, low content books. This is what this is. So you can actually create a book along with me. You can watch me over the shoulder as I create my new workbook slash coloring book, journal, newsletter, the warrior book that I showed you earlier. And you can create it right along with me so you can stay on track and have a finished book in 30 days or less. This is really, really cool. $197 value. And then I think finally, uh, bonus number five is the coloring book overlay. And if you remember the example we gave earlier with the bride and the mandalas in the background, sometimes what you want to do is you want to spruce up your coloring book. So let's say you have, you're doing like a kid's birthday. You want to maybe take out the, the kid and, and incorporate some other coloring book aspects to that picture so that you can make it more interesting and more interactive for the person actually coloring it in. So for example, the, that, that bride, I actually did a whole book for my friends and a lot of those pictures, the bride was standing in front of a, like the whole wedding party. They, it was all one scene. They were standing in front of these trees and it's kind of boring after a while seeing the trees in the background. So I had the bright idea of just isolating the people and then uh, incorporating some cool stuff in the background. So I'm going to show you exactly how I do that. We call that the coloring book overlay, how to remove the backgrounds, getting free images that you can use, and then putting them all together. That's a $297 bonus. So to kind of sum it all up, here's what you're getting. You're getting the uh, line art software tool, which Rob showed you. This is a $997 value. The Mac software training, $497 value. The live monthly marketing training where Rob takes you behind the scenes of how to market these books and new ideas on what to bring to the table and getting creative because that's what really, really, really sells in this, in this market. And then all the bonuses, bonus number one, the Speedboat Print Publishing, the Author Magnets Masterclass, Marketing Yourself as an Author, the Ingram Spark interview with Judith Bryles, the book printing updates, the create a book in 30 days, and the coloring book overlay, the total value of over to almost $3,000. So I'm going to hand it back to you, Rob. I think people are probably ready to All ask right. questions and also get to that link where they can go ahead and purchase. 